Today we're going to talk about a compositional technique that when implemented can help you take more interesting photos. Let's get right into it. Subframing is essentially the technique of creating a frame within a frame. This is most commonly used to bring the viewer's attention to your subject. You can implement subframing quite literally, like in this example, but there are more subtle ways in which you can implement it as well. You can use elements from your background, foreground, light, textures, colors, and any combination of these to strengthen your composition. When executed well, subframing will immediately show the viewer where to look. It can also provide additional interest to the photo and add depth. The great thing about adding more compositional techniques to your photography toolbox is you can use it for a variety of different genres of photography and filmmaking. You can use it in street photography, fashion, commercial, or even just when you're on vacation. We're gonna walk around our neighborhood with our model Kyra and see if we can find some more subframing examples. Let's get that bread. No more bread. Let's go. Hey, Rach, do you remember our Skillshare password? I'm trying to get my learn on. Yeah, I think it's Skillshare Lover 69. Oh, duh, that's my password for everything. Should have known. What classes are you thinking of taking? Well, there's over 25,000 to choose from, but I was gonna brush up on some music theory. You should actually take a candle making class so you can finally get started and get off the ground. Well, you know, I just have a hard time creating in the same place I work, but uh, we'll see. Did you know there's some beginner drumming classes that you should check out? This is about me. This is about the seven people who are taking Skillshare classes and loving it. Well, it makes sense. An annual subscription is less than $10 a month, and the first 500 people who sign up with the link in our description will get their first two months for free. I should definitely do that. And I should brush up on my drumming if I ever want to be in Scrimmicity 3. No one ever says goodbye anymore. Next time you're out shooting, give this technique a shot and let us know how it goes. Be sure to subscribe and hit that little dinger so you won't miss a new video, and we'll see you in the next one.